Welcome to Dog World TV on a thankfully sunny day two of Southern Counties Championship Dog Show. Now, if you've been watching Dog World TV for more than a couple of years, this man's face will have bored you about two years ago. Yeah, two years ago, that <laughs> my husband now. <laughs> um, you're, you're on the committee here. Is yep. uh, all going well so far? Yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, it's totally different than Sean Dogs. It's a busy, fun-filled week. Dealing with the weather, dealing with exhibitors. And dog yep. shows would be great if it wasn't for exhibitors. Um, <laughs> yeah, no, the grass is all nice and short and the sun's shining today, unlike yesterday, so, yeah. Going it's well. Good. It's good. Um, now, these are these are different questions to the ones you're used to on, on our cameras. I'll prepare myself, shall yeah. I? Yeah, uh, you haven't won anything today, so oh. we're... These are slightly different. Okay. Um, so, we'll start from top. What's your affix and where does it come from? Okay, uh, our affix is Soul Trainer. And many people for a long time thought it had various permutations, but it was very simple. We were looking, and Sarah and I got together for a new affix, the joint one, and we went shopping one day for a pair of shoes, and <laughs> out jumped the shop sign that said Soul Trainer. So that's a great name, Hence Soul Trainer. <laughs> so very boring, but very simple. Yeah. So that's it. Um, what's your favorite word? My favourite word, well I've got a very bad memory for people's names, so I say love regularly, <laughs> which really annoys a lot of people who know me, because I can't remember people's names, so love. Uh, what's, what's your least favourite word? No. Why, you know, why do you have to say no? There's always an answer to things. Things can always be resolved. I don't like the word no. <laughs> um, what turns you on? My wife? There's a right answer there. <laughs> there you are. And it didn't pause for too long when I said that, did you? I'm not sure, I'm not sure. My wife. Um, what turned you off? My wife shouting at me. <laughs> <laughs> what profession, other than your own, would you like to do? Well, I was asked before I got into full-time dogs to be a underwear model for Arani. Right, okay. But I had the choice of showing dogs or doing that, so I declined on the underwear model status. So do you want, do you want to give us a, an example now? Well, I've not got the right beach wear on today, oh, okay. and my legs aren't that tanned. But that would be my preferred choice, <laughs> okay. had I not gone into dog showing dogs. And um, what wouldn't you like to do? Be a model for hairspray, because I don't think I get much no, work. not a lot of to work. To be honest. So no. I think on that alone. <laughs> I would no use for adverts for Hellnet. What about your uh, your greatest achievement in dogs? Um, I would say that pretty obvious question for us. Yeah. I would say best in short crafts for sure. Not long ago, and it, it must stay in the mind uh, daily. every day. Every day, if somebody mentions it or we think about it. So yeah, without shadow of a doubt, everyone wants to win it, and it is fantastic. So. What about outside of dogs? Outside of dogs, um, what as an achievement I'd like yeah. to do? Yeah, greatest, greatest achievement outside of dogs. I'd like to do, that I'd like to do or I've done? That you've done, that you've done. Do you know what? And I know it may sound tweed to some people, I think the whole after Crofts thing and then putting to get, helping put together a charity, I don't want to sound like a Miss World answer where I want to- World peace. World peace and hunger and all that, but seriously, that you get that's, that's given a lot of pleasure. Yeah, yeah of putting the charity together for dog people, you know? And, I mean, I, w I went with you to the Great Ormond Street the, the day you saw, you handed over that, that big check. Yeah, yeah. And to see, you know, to have started the charity process and see where it's going to the children it's going towards yeah. was a really emotional day. Yeah, it was, it was really emotional. And it, it kind of gives you more of a drive to carry on doing, doing things for charity, which we are doing onwards and, and further forward. So, yeah, probably, I would say the charity is really good. Right, back on track. Um, what breed, other than your own, would you like to own? Uh, other than the ones you already own, well, what would you like? I have a list, so it's not easy. So <laughs> thankfully my wife's not on your shop, because the list can go on. Pointers, yeah. I love whippets. Um, I love poodles, but uh, I'm getting too old to stand behind a dryer for even more hours than <laughs> I do right now. But probably a pointer, love them. Yeah. Um, and what about a show dog from any time and any place that you could award your ultimate best in show to, who would it be? Right, that's a tricky question because from men, obviously it's helpful if you've seen the dogs and not just pictures. Mm. Um, and there is the the usual suspects for obvious reasons, like Torum Scarf Michael the Kerry was fabulous. Yogi was a great dog. Um, Gonna have to push you. The, the clock's ticking. I know the clock's ticking. Um, <laughs> the greatest dog. No, I'll tell you what, the, right, the greatest dog, and I'm going to give the reasons for it, was 
the white standard poodle, mm. top score con- top score contradiction event, best in short cuffs from Norway. Yeah, yeah. And do you know what? Some of the poodle people may say he wasn't the greatest poodle, but as a show dog, for the moments that you saw him, was absolutely pure brilliance and style and, and everything about a poodle. I thought it was a great dog, and I we competed against him a few times with with the dog in Europe and over mm. here, and he was a, that was a great dog. It was a great dog. Not not perfect, but a great dog. So that's that's the question. No, no, no dog's perfect. So yeah, top score contradiction. Fantastic. Thank you very much, Gavin. Thank you. Uh, you know, you never might get in the grip ring again one one Maybe day or another. One day. You know, one day. But your wife's it's my wife. Yeah, your wife's I'm doing retired. all the winning at the minute. I'm sacked. <laughs> I'm sacked. Yeah. Well, thank you very much, Gavin. Thank Best of luck for the rest of the show. Cool. Thank you. Yeah. I've got more editing to do that than anybody else. Yeah. On the <laughs>